Hello aviators and welcome to a new topic which is called as forces acting on an aircraft. Now uh, most of us have seen an aircraft fly in the air and uh, traveling from one destination to another. Now we have to understand what are the forces also that are there that are acting on an aircraft. Now when I say forces acting on an aircraft it means what are the positive forces which are helping an aircraft to fly in the air and which are the negative forces which are trying to bring down the aircraft okay or reduce the speed of the aircraft so we'll start with the first one which is called as the lift of the aircraft now in the previous video of the Bernoulli's principle we have discussed how a lift is achieved okay so it is the same thing when an aircraft uh, have wing having an aerofoil shape it moves forward a differential pressure is caused and that indeed uh, helps in generating the lift of the aircraft okay then the second positive force which helps the aircraft to fly and sustain in the air is the thrust okay thrust is achieved by the engines or turbines of the aircrafts okay so uh, many aircrafts are equipped with two engines they are also called as multi engine single engine or uh, the huge aircraft which have four to six engines okay so they provide a force which is called as thrust of the aircraft okay and then there are two negative uh, forces which are always trying which are always acting on the aircraft and trying to bring down the aircraft that is one of which is a natural force it is called as uh, gravity gravity is always on uh, acting on the aircraft or else it's a natural force acting on human beings or every object on this planet which is uh, bringing uh, which is keeping the objects grounded as well right so it is continuously forcing the aircraft to come down that is called as gravity the next one is the drag now to explain drag if you uh, if you people might have uh, driven a vehicle and when you are going at a higher speeds say on 100 km per hour and the oncoming wind which is uh, which is coming from the forward which is coming from forward okay now just to experience when you crouch down while driving the vehicle or a bike the momentum or the velocity of the air, uh, bike Im immediately increases that is because you are reducing the drag by crouching forward that is what you notice in the MotoGP drivers or the racers do they crouch down to reduce the drag okay which indeed helps uh, forming good aerodynamics right so the same principle is uh, is also there for the aircrafts which is the drag it is always it is always acting on the aircraft all right so uh, these are the four uh, forces which are continuously acting on the aircraft and uh, to put it as simple as that they are lift thrust gravity and drag do let me know if you have any doubts in this topic in the comment session and uh, uh, we will uh, and we'll discuss in the later videos as well thank you